dear students next concept of oblique projectile motion is radius of curvature at any point on trajectory of projectile so here we consider an object which is thrown with velocity u from point of projection o by making an angle theta with horizontal so the object is traveling in parabolic path due to gravity so here we want to measure at any point uh, on its trajectory radius of curvature so at this trajectory let the velocity vector of the projectile is v velocity vector of the projectile is v here acceleration due to gravity is acting vertically downward direction so here i draw rectangular lines here this angle is equal to 90 minus theta so therefore this is equal to theta therefore component of g along this direction is uh, g cos theta component of g along this direction is uh, g sin theta so here g cos theta and v are perpendicular to each other so now we want to measure radius of curvature at this point so here g cos theta is acting towards the center of this circle so it provides a necessary centripetal acceleration so ac is equal to g cos theta but we know that expression for centripetal acceleration is v square by r so v square by r equal to g cos theta therefore r is equal to v square by g cos theta here to measure this radius of curvature we must know the value of v so the velocity of the projectile after time t is obtained from v is equal to u plus at already i explained determination of velocity after time t in our previous videos so v is equal to initial velocity vector is u cos theta i cap plus u sin theta j cap plus acceleration vector is g minus j cap into t therefore velocity after time t is given by u cos theta i cap plus u sin theta minus g t j cap so by using this equation we measure the magnitude of velocity v is equal to square root of u cos theta whole square plus u sin theta minus gt whole square thank you